Hi guys, welcome. I would like to play a little bit with CHADWM. I have uh, virtual machines, and if I don't, I'll install it. And I play with what ifs in a virtual machine, never on your real metal thing. So, CHDWM, if you see this thing, you do right control and then F and right control F. So, we have the full screen available to ourselves. Probably it needs an update since last time. So, there you go. Update the system. The what if that I have is because a user on Telegram. CHDWM is one of the, well, a fork of DWM and has been for 2023 my desktop, my working environment on ISO Builder. So this is what you get with CHDWM, the stuff that we have on our repos. Now, if we go first, let's have a look. What did I do already to this machine? Oh yeah, so BSP is already installed to the machine and it's just the ISO of the XL, the older ISO, ISO the, the one from June, not the release in one week for July. So that's that's the basis, right? That's the platform on which we have played already. So CHADWM, one of the easiest things in Arcolix is the Control Alt and then E, which launches the Arcolix Tweak tool. We gets which gets everything done need already, but it goes on. I mean, this is our CHDWM which is again then a fork, well, a adaptation of the fork of CHDWM. And I'd like to do something more, something different, have a look at something that's online. So if you look out, you get now the choice between BSPWM, CHDWM, and it's as simple as that in Arclex, right? Done. Control T, we're now on CHDWM. This is my environment, my ecosystem for 2023. Now, the idea that I have came because I went to PAMAC. Um, no, I did not. I went to the AWAR, that's how I did it, and then typed in CHDWM. Then I saw a new line. So look at that, what's that? So this is information and I did a control C, I believe, went to Firefox, typed it in. So let's see if I can mimic again the steps I took. And then I said, don't do it on real metal. My brain went to an alert, alert mode <laughs> and said, don't do it here, right? Do it on a virtual machine. So this, is this that is that that's the link that's how i went to this particular gitlab so we have some screenshots and he's uh, looking quite nicely right this guy that made it and there we have things we can install from aor you can install manually sudo make install and so forth so a lot of information the patches he included and it's a fork from right so it's an ad adaptation my own version of CHDWM and so on. Question is, can we have a look, right? Basically, that's all like this. Can we have a look? So, I don't know what happens if I click here. Let's see. Control Shift V. Then you get everything, three lines in one go. Does that work? Of course not. <laughs> Control C. Let's do Control C, stop. Yep, yep, okay. Control Shift V is gonna put it in the dot config. Let's have a look. Already exists, it's not an empty directory. Fine, then we put it in what shall we call it? Just dev or something or chdwm dev. Alright, it's in there. So you go to the configuration and then we have this one and then we call it def ls right so in there we've got stuff 
scripts, Rofi, package build, chddwm, and what I need to do is tell them make install, make first make, no, sudo make install is they say here up here in the website, sudo make install. Let's see if that works. No rule to make target install. So what did we miss? Is there something in there that we should have a look at? Let's go. Oh yeah, probably I know what I did. Control H dot config. This is ours, right? This is the other guy. You shouldn't build up here because nothing is in here. You should put build in here, of course. So make and on sudo make install. So if we super, this is of, of course something problematic. I don't know what and I'll get into. This is the screenshot. Are there key bindings that I should know of? Don't know. There is bar sh fetch. What happened to my system? File system, user, share, X sessions. This one, what happened to it? It's still my own, very much my own, exec chdwm. So what we've replaced is dwm. So basically I can't boot from SDM because BSP at WM is here, CHWM is there. So basically I do here open folder as root. Control C, Control V. Tell them that's DWM, for example. So I get a choice. And then in here, why don't you open up? I tell him to open up with DWM probably. Save. So which DWM? Use a local bin. Okay. Somewhere else. Use a local bin. DWM. Save. So we got a desktop file, super X log out and uh, let's see if we break everything so oh forgot to do something there so still named chddwm inside the file but this definitely is not mine which is nice i like it but it's not mine so what do we change more sudo nano user share x sessions and then dwm that name is correct, but not inside. So in here, we tell them that it's DWM. All right, execute, yes, please, thank you. And then that's fine. So if we super X is probably not gonna work. So Arch Linux logout is gonna work. Let's see if we can log out. And open up, there we go, DWM. So this is the config, this is the definitely the config of the other guy right not me the other guy now buttons here are what they are there is a button down here i see so pavo control is there super x is not working super shift q is working but it's throwing me back to sdtm so basically use something else <laughs> why not show you bspwm so you've seen that as well super c use something else alt n and var let's get me some wallpapers alt n and you'll see more nicer wallpapers than these guys you have to investigate anything new anything not arclex you have to investigate chdwm dev Basically, launch Sublime Text. 
then take a folder drop it in there and then you read every single thing read me right anything that is called read me you read here's the package build license git ignore scripts the bar the bar is defined this way fetch and run as h is interesting to see because this is booting up your stuff and of course there is no pictures wall gruff png so you find yourself a nice wallpaper actually probably i've already variety fetched hopefully some downloaded noops some fetched let's see variety is there preferences wall haven that's cool but nothing in yet i guess sometimes variety needs to quit and super d needs to get launched again it's the way it is it's free software after all so here is one wallpaper already they're coming in sure why not it's just an example so we have here the copy and you have here this well so i'm telling him that's where you can find a gpg a png safe so when i log out and I log back in not that one but this one i should get a wallpaper which looks a bit nicer but no it doesn't do that so as usual investigate 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 so config this one is gonna go to the script it's gonna go to the run as h what did i do wrong home eric config variety downloadable i don't see anything wrong with it but it's not working hence hence the power of variety <laughs> whatever <laughs> right safe let's see if variety kicks in super x oops that's not gonna work so logging out is definitely and all my key bindings are gonna be in in here config dev h there will be key bindings but not the ones i want here are all the key bindings and we have the sexy hotkey demon which is not launched now to have more so control c p kill dwm we are thrown out and sdm kicks in again and let's see if the wallpaper now works is variety launching because we see this little sign here but is he actually launching something because then you need to investigate why is it not launching and stuff like that all right and that's it right it's always time wasted or time well spent that's your decision but it's always figuring out how does this work how does this compute and whether or not you go for analyzing what it's why it doesn't tick or why it doesn't do things but it's in here somewhere some code because let's see variety just launches let's see that um do we have super d do we have super p yep we have super o i'm just going over the alphabet now that's something super t was that i think we're now in this thing here key bindings you know what i always say read 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 the config but here you go i'm just pressing buttons <laughs> now look at that another sign here something changed so i wanted to launch a variety in the background 
And indeed, there is an icon up here. And we do have a wallpaper. But killing things. Uh, it's rounded. Now we see it's rounded with the wallpaper. Not really a fan of rounded things. Although Hyperland is looking not that bad, right? It's actually looking great. Voila. But killing stuff. I don't know. Super C? No. Super Q was not working. Super A? Super Shift Q was working, but then everything was stopped. The only thing I can do with this one is exit. But then I have still that one. <laughs> Close. Ah, voila. So the wallpaper is working as long as I use my trustworthy variety. And variety downloads everything for me. And this is also a nice one. Use this quite a bit. Close. There you go. I'm already tired, but go ahead and explore configs of other people. But read, nah, launch Sublime Text. Somehow I need to be able to launch applications in this system. But read the code, the config, and add more. Maybe to the SXHQD application where you can put in uh, keyboard shortcuts. Open this with if key combo and then open something like that. All right. Have fun exploring CH. DWM. Cheers.